Aloha, YouTubers. So it's now almost month five. Crazy. There's a lot of improvements since my last frustration video where it was all over the place. I actually wasn't going to put that on YouTube, but I'm going to put that on YouTube because I think documenting my experience accurately should be what I should be doing because I've been doing it all along. Why change it now? <laughs> So if my hair's gotten a lot longer, gotten a little stronger from the gym, and my eyes, thank God, also improved. So there's been a lot of improvement going on. Last video, I was very frustrated. A little confusion in the office. The surgeon, thank God, caught onto it very quickly and corrected everybody. But at month three, they wanted to initially, they thought that was enough time to do a retreatment. Um, again, that would have been the third time my eyes would have been touched. First, the LASIK went bad. Now the PRK went bad. The left eye is still not catching up. The right eye has always been fantastic. I would have been very, very, very distraught. I was starting to question the technology, the procedure, the process, the research, the surgeon. Everything went up uh, as, a, as a question in my book. But still wearing the gunner glasses because they're really nice to use on a computer. Um, I don't wear them, of course, when I don't use the computer. I have my trusty Maui Gym Shades. If you can get expensive sunglasses, do it. Do it, do it, do it. Your eyes are worth it. You paid so much for the surgery. Get $300 sunglasses, at least $150. Don't do the Prada. Don't do the fashion labels. They don't have the lens quality that your eyes need. They only have the stupid label on the side. Maui gyms are expensive because their lenses go through rigorous engineering. You are going to need these outside to protect those eyes and the sensitivity. Sensitivity isn't actually that bad. I just don't want to wear them out, um, and I don't want to do anything that's bad for the eyes. Luckily, I've already had a very good habit of wearing good sunglasses. Um, but again, Maui gyms... Revos, Oakleys, something with engineering in the lens. Don't go for the Versace's, the stupid brand, you know, the labels. They look fashionable, but they don't have engineering in the lens like these do. Okay, with that said, the gunners also have engineering in the lens for the computer screen or for any types of monitors that you're going to be staring at all day. If you are air traffic control people or pilots that aren't flying and you have to look at screens all day, these are great. Don't know if they're recommended for flying. Um, you know what to wear for flying. Anyway, that being said, we're now at four months. Uh, now into the, actually hit the fifth month anniversary next week in August. And I am excited. My little blips in time of crisp vision since my last YouTube video have slowly been stretching out, you know, from hours to almost full days. And I am very confident that the um, left eye will finally settle in and catch up with the right eye. I think, although I'm not tested yet, I am better than 2020 in the right eye. And I think I'm at least 2020 in the left eye. And I'm hoping that they, they're both the same number. That may not happen. Uh, but I'm really hoping that the left eye and the right eye lock in at the same number. Um, that would be really nice because I can, I can see very slight differences. Right now, when I look outside, the window's there. So when I look outside and I cover one eye over the other, I do see just a little detail difference um, in the left eye than I do with the right eye. I'm still on the Lodamax one time in the morning, one time at night. Check with your doctor if you should still be on that. And so far, so good. I will check up with you on my six-month video, however, um, to see how this left eye finally settles in. I've been using my, um, non -pre my preservative free drops, you know, as often as I need them. I have been noticing that, that I need them less when I'm doing active stuff outside. When I'm doing computer stuff, I still use them a little bit more. They're fairly great. I found that the Bao Shalom ones actually from Costco um, or your wholesale club are great. They're called Refresh Plus. They're not thick. They're not greasy. They're a little watery, but they last a while. And when I'm going to go and walk away from the computer and take a break, I should put a drop in each. It feels fantastic. Everything looks like 2010 outside, especially for the first few blinks. Um, so, yeah, these are, these are really great. Um, but if you have any questions, post them in the comment section, and I'm pretty good about getting back to you. So um, 
thanks for watching and we'll see you in a couple of weeks aloha